What's up, YouTube? We back with another video. Let's get to it. All right, so today I'm gonna be showing y'all how to change the laces from the original color that's found on both shoes when you first open the box to these that come in this Nike package that you can change them into. As you can see, I've already switched one of these into one of these. That's why my laces in here are mismatched. All right, so like I said, when you first open the box, it's gonna come in this color, but you have the chance to change them into this color if you want to. So the way that you put these in is first you take them out, which is fairly simple. All right, so now that you have the laces removed, you can replace it with the light pink laces or the dark pink laces. Me personally, I like the mismatch theme, so I'm keeping one as the original color, and then I'm gonna add the dark pink lace from the bag. So what you wanna do first is first, um, when you take it out of the bag, it might be a little bit wrinkled, but you just wanna straighten the lace out as much as you can. And then on both sides, start from the outside, just like this one. See how it starts from the outside? Start from the outside on this shoe. Like this. Pull it in just a little bit. And then make sure it's all straight. And then pull this one in there. When you hold them together, Pull up, boom. There you have the first part. All right, so the next step is, if you look on this shoe, you come in, you go through this loop. You see, you come, so you start from the outside, you come in, you go through this loop. So on this shoe, you come in, you make sure the lace is straight, You go through this loop. And since you're going like this, it might be a little bit turny, twisty and turny. You know, it's not gonna be the most straight thing ever, but you just gotta make the best of it. And then on this side, you're gonna do the same thing. You come from the outside, you go through, you straighten the lace out, and you go through this loop. And you pull it. And then you go back on this shoe, and it says, next step is when you come through here, you go out this little hole and through this cage and then around. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this lace, make sure it's all straight once again. Go through this hole right here, through the cage, out. Straight again. And then around into this little loop. Ah, uh, having a hard time. All right, there we go. And then do the same thing on this side. Take the lace, make sure it's straight. Straight as possible, at least. If it's not as straight as you want it to be, don't get frustrated, don't get down on yourself, it happens. And then come through this side, go through the loop, go through the cage, and pull it through. So now you have this one pulled through the cage, and you go around and through this loop again, 
and pull. It's not coming out as straight as I want to, but like I said, it happens. Just gotta pull it back out, hold it right here, and just guide it in. And then you just wanna pull both of them up at the same time and just make sure they're even. And then once you know they're even, you once again look at this shoe and look for the next step. So we already went through this cage around and through this loop. And now we're going through this hole and going through the second half of the cage. So I'm gonna take the lace once again, straighten it out. Go through this loop. And through the second half of the cage. And we're gonna do that on both sides. Straighten it out through this loop. And through the second half of the cage. Hmm, I wonder what's going on here. So like I said, it's not always gonna be the most even, but just gotta make the most of it. And look over here one more time. Once you go out the cage, you go through this final loop, and then that's it. So I'm gonna straighten it out, go through this final loop, Pull it as straight as possible. Take the other side. Do the same thing. Pull it as straight as possible. Hold on, let me do that. And then boom. You're done. Now you got the mismatched laces. And yeah, that's it for today's review. All right, so that's it for today's video. I appreciate y'all for checking in. Feel free to comment down below how you feel about the video or any recommendations for what my next video should be. And yeah, that's it. I'm out, y'all.